Seven ten miles to Luton. Delta seven seventy nine, contact Boston Center one three five point three two. See you later. So at this point, I'm thinking about my first turn and holding. What direction, what heading do I turn outbound to? Um, there are 762 Boston Center radar contact line maintain 7000 line altimeter 3012. And it's kind of teardrop me to a, to a uh, 142 in the back end. It's going to be a parallel entry. So just a direct turn 142. Because you're coming at it at a 90 degree angle. So put your heading bug on the outbound heading and then you'll see what the orientation of the turn is relative to where you where you are. So you can see it's a 90 degree turn. So you might as well just turn and go parallel outbound. You know what I mean? Parallel outbound. In other words, you're going to turn left and you're going to parallel the course on the non-maneuvering side. On the non-maneuvering side? Yep, uh, you're going to come across, you're going to turn left, fly on over that, on this side, yeah. and then you're going to do this. You're going to do this, essentially, this little blue ground track. But I'll do a 142 out here? Or uh, just on top of the... No, it'll be almost on top. You're going to yeah. be slightly okay. south, watch your altitude. You're going to be slightly south of the course, because your turn radius will take you beyond after you cross, but you'll be parallel. So this is called the parallel entry. You're not really aligned for a direct entry, which is the a right-hand turn. Number two, Mike Lima, cross Hooten at about 4,000, cleared on everyone, one way, three, two, approach, orange. Uh, Hooten at about 4,000, we'd like to do the uh, course of Rosal at Hooten. Report, proceed to turn inbound. He said report, proceed to turn inbound. So did you say to Mike Lima? To Mike Lima, report, proceed to turn inbound. Report procedure turn inbound, 172 Mike Lima. Alright, so you're not cleared to approach, but you're cleared to do the procedure turn. And then once you're procedure turn inbound, then he'll clear you the final portion. So I'm cleared down to 4,000. Cleared down to 4. Mike Victor, Boston Center, climb and maintain flight level 230. Fly your present heading, expect to turn westbound to clear some traffic. Kind of, that's showing. 508, cross Sea Dog at 11,000, Portland Elsevier, 3006. Sea Dog at 11,000, 3006, chip 508. Air 762, contact Boston approach, 124.9. How would I come back now? So I think if you... Um, there. So I got you slightly right or left, of course. Shows on your CDI as well.
Good morning, Charlie Fox, India Papa Number with you, flight level 230. Charlie Fox, Charlie, India Papa November, Boston Center, right here. JetBlue 508, contact Boston Center 128.2. 128.2, JetBlue 508. Missouri Mike Victor, flighting 270. Miles, and I'm going to do a left turn. One four two. Where am I going? Charlie Fox, Charlie, India Papa, November, December, maintain flight level two one zero. Flight level two one zero for India Papa, November. Charlie Foster, India, Papa November, traffic 10 o'clock, 15 miles westbound at 20. Is it King Air? I'll have lower clearing. So the Fox, India, Papa November, Roger, look for the traffic. Yeah, we did 873, traffic 2 o'clock, 15 miles southeastbound. We'll be leveling 1,000 above a Pilatus. Look for the traffic, yeah, we did 873. You know, these controllers need to go fly once and, t and then try to figure out if you can see traffic at 15 miles. <laughs> <laughs> Joe Mike Victor flighting two eight zero. I think what they're the reason why they're doing those advisories is they're yeah, holding eight seven three contact Boston Center one two one point three five. Twenty one thirty five for Gamma Jet eight seventy three. Thanks for your help today. They're holding sure. holding people at certain altitudes until the traffic passes, so then they can clear them lower. Has a further mission at Sierra Tango Zulu Valley for the Northeast. Double on flight. All right, so that has my, my yep. parallel. Parallel, so you're just going to fly the dotted line. Yeah. Whoops. <laughs> fly the dotted line. And then it's telling you to hold parallel. Front of 36 Boston. So it's giving you a lead uh, turn, so you're going to turn before you get two. there because of the turn radius. And there you go. Passed it a little bit. So, Mike Victor, you're going to be in this heading just for a little bit here. you got three Boston arrivals that will be descending for your altitude. You're not quite quick enough to get in front of them. So, if it's high altitude sector, we'll get you southwest um, as we're able. I didn't keep my turn in. So I went past. Charlie Fox, 
Charlie Foxtrot, India, Papa, November, December 19, 15,000. The Boston Alpha Minute 3008. Center 15,000, 3008. Fox India, Papa, November. Thank you. Number zero, Mike Victor, Connect Boston Center 135.32. I was thinking I was going the other way. Yep, I know. It, yeah. But see, the solid line is, so you're going to do that more than 180 degrees a turn. Rick here at 5633, 2833, descend 240. Rick here at 5633, Boston Center, descend via the J-Fund 2 arrival, runway 33 left, Logan Altimeter oh, 3008. All right, to send via the J-Fund to runway 33 left, 3008 on the altimeter, Rickyard 5633, and we can start bringing the speed back up again as smooth out. I don't want to cut this too tight. No, you're fine, because you could just, all you need to do is re-intercept the course going the other way, so this turn Rickyard radius, 15, uh, but the tighter, if you go tight, it's Rickyard fine. 7 Boston, to send via the J Fund 2 arrival from way 3 3 left. Unless you have wind that you have to account for. Rickyard 3 to send via the J Fund arrival of 3 3 left, Rickyard 5715. For uh, for Rickyard 5633, do you want, us to, you want us to maintain 300 knots or better, or do you want us to comply with the star speed? Send via. Uh, you can tell approach for procedure turn inbound or center. I tell them in one shot. Yeah. This is considered inbound, not. Yep, we're yeah. inbound. Boston Center 172, Mike Lemus, procedure turn inbound. 172, Mike Lemus, Roger. Report the missed approach, airborne this frequency, change advisory frequency approved. Report the missed approach and uh, change the advisory factor on the miss. 172, Mike Lima. All right, so we're clear to your approach. Boston Delta 990-33, descending level 240. So he didn't say Delta that, though. Boston, he did prior, you know, well, we told him, he said you're cleared to RNAV, then he said, so we're cleared, the approach has published. via the J-Fund 2 for uh, 33 left, Delta 990. Uh, India Papa November, increase your rate descent, expect to cross goalie at 6. Push the top. There you go. Well, I don't be the first to look down on you. Take a picture. Yeah, but you're going to go by like a jet. That base. Yeah, Brooklyn 3300. It will be a full stop. 3, 2, 1. I doubt that. 91.8 knots, 92 knots. 119. Over Amherst schools. Okay, any distances? I want distance to the runway. First image traffic, white Cessna overflying the field at 1,600 oh, to enter the left down. Too much math, Three, right? Three, five. He's turning uh, still. Crosswind to 3-3, three, three, bro. Okay, 12 miles out. Probably, yeah. Bumpy, no? Nah, it's nice and smooth. Just kind of add that to the brief. Yep. So you can just look at your approach plate and add up all the distances prior to the briefing. So it's 5 plus 2 plus 1 plus 2. So your Hooten is 10 miles out. So when you're, when you're at Hooten, just report 10 miles for straight in runway 32. All right, so how do you know where you are position-wise? Well, you got it on the chart there, but on this. Okay. Well, I know I'm... There you go. So now you're at Hooten. See how it changed over? Now I'm at Hooten. Yeah, Hooten to O-Mass is the next. First given traffic, white Cessna over the field at 1600, 10 to the left, now in 3-3, first given. Yeah, I'm in 
right, yeah. I'm looking for you. Orange traffic, November 172, Mike Lamas, 10 southeast, straight in for runway 32. Orange. The problem is that we have a caper, we have a couple of people to be at the final here. Sounds there down at 2500. Back here on site as well. Short final, uh, at uh, the top. Orange traffic, runway 2, departing left to the west. That was two to the west, north here, or minor field. I am three miles to Omas, which is my final. I'm back on course. We're going to try for that white series. Uh, we're picking off 3-3. Three, three. We're going to try again. We're okay. I'll configure with two miles to go. Come back to my right. 500 feet to go. Well, I'm, I w want to turn left. <laughs> yeah. Something about the foggles makes me do that. Doesn't seem to happen without them. Okay, two miles. I'm going to configure. Laps. One, two, three. One, two, three. One mile to Omas. 100 feet to Omas. traffic, Skyline 5 0 cells turning left base. Runway 4, cap. Car feet. Forces to my right, of course. Do a complete paranoia check. Complete paranoia check. Fuel, trim, mixture. There we go. Good. There's 2,500. Shadow traffic, got your 5 3 fog, turning downwind runway. Shadow. Shadow traffic, Shadow 5 0 south, turning final 2 4 10. This is not going to my next. Third down to 1600. Coming back on my course. Jam traffic 672, right across the runway 24, departing the area to the northwest. Jam. Hello. Okay, zoo gag. Third down to 16. Zoo gag. Sometimes final. we got a Marine Survey Skymaster just off a of reef point orbiting 1000. Problem done. Shadow of traffic, Centurion is uh, Robertson final. traffic 1640, Whiskey downwind uh, runway 2, Robertson 45, Police downwind of runway 6, Shadow. Shadow of traffic, got your 534. Robertson traffic, Cherokee, he's turning left, downwind for 02, number 2, Robertson. Half model zoo gag down to 16. I'm high. Oh, there's my glide slope. Orange traffic, Cherokee 73 Romeo. 5 to the southwest, gonna enter a left downwind from runway 32 Orange. Shadow traffic, got your 5 3 Fox turning final runway 212. Shadow. Never saw you. Am I in front of you now? Yeah, I'm showing six out. Four out right now. A little bit of 
clouds over the airport. Nothing major. I want to get out. Yeah, all right. Orange traffic, 172 Mike Lima, two mile final runway 32, low approach, orange. Center traffic, three miles to the west of the uh, flying over here. 1,600 for lift down. 700 to go. Two mile final, course is to my left. Right slope, I need to come down. Foot descent, maybe a 700 foot descent. On. Center line. Right slope is coming up. Robertson, traffic 1640, whiskey, final, runway 2, Robertson. Take the foggles off. Continue the approach. Robertson, traffic, circuit 78 x all right, 1100 is 873, so I got 200 feet to go. Of course, to my right, I'm high. Make an advisory call. Orange traffic, 172, Mike Lima, one mile final, 32, orange. Cherokee, 73, Romeo is uh, entering midfield, down, left downwind, runway 32, orange. All right, execute the missed approach. How do I do that? Activate GPS missed approach. On suspend. There you go. Three, two, one. Horse traffic 172, Mike Lima on the missed runway 32. Traffic? Yep, that's on. That's why I'm talking. So he's behind us and he was on the downwind. Going to three two. Where? So let's do this. Seven three Romeo's turning base for runway three two orange. Do I not get missed instruction there? Uh, uh, sure base. You got him here. So if you want to go to flight plan, Sigpa. There you go. Have a uh, wet best now turning left downwind, uh, runway 33. All right, let's sign out of CTAF and go back to center. Orange traffic 172, Mike Lima departing to the northwest. Orange traffic. Thirty-five eighteen. Envoy thirty-five eighteen one three thousand and direct to Gons G O N Z Z. Center 172 Mike Lima on the miss at Orange. 172 Mike Lima, Boston Roger, shoot the published miss. Just tell them we're on the published miss. On the published miss, 172 Mike Lima. Fog goes back on. Flat Papa Delta to center maintain 6,000. 6,000 public open.
Mike Lima, what else are you looking for en route to Hartford? Let's go to uh, 4,000 feet. Request 4,000, 172 Mike Lima. 172 Mike Lima, climb maintain 4,000. Climb maintain 4,000, 172 Mike Lima. Five Papa Delta, connect approach one two four point four. Twenty four four approach, Papa Delta. Envoy thirty five eighteen, climb maintain full two three zero. So once you get to 4,000, leveled off, cruise airspeed, ask for direct Hartford VOR. Yeah, Mike Lima, approach request, climb, maintain 6,000, and you're cleared to Hartford via direct. Is that us? Hold on. Two Mike Lima, approach request, climb, maintain 6,000. 172 Mike Lima. Yeah, that's for you. Once, I don't know. I two Mike Lima, climbing up to uh, 6,000 feet. And two Mike Lima, you're cleared direct Hartford at this time, maintain 6,000. Direct Hartford to Mike Lima, requesting direct Hartford VOR. Uh, to Mike Lima, for now, direct the airport, make the request for the VOR with Bradley, and your radar contact now, four and a half miles to the west, leaving 4,000. To Mike Lima, up to 6,000, direct Hartford Airport. To Mike Lima, contact Bradley, approach 12535, and like I said, we state the request for the VOR, you should have no problem approving it. 2535, to Mike Lima. All right. You hit the. I can. I was confused. Did you hit the play button? I did. That was, yeah, that's okay. what happened. Okay. So first, let's turn direct Hartford Airport yeah. in the climb. Just go to where you think the heading is. Guess. Yes. Yeah. Like uh, south one eight zero. There you go. So let's turn first. Then we'll worry about talking and reprogram the GPS. Not figure out how we was talking. Charlie Pop, get a Bradley approach one 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 nine point zero nineteen zero. Nineteen zero for three Charlie Pop. So on, sir. Yeah. Yeah, I pressed the play button. Yeah. <laughs> so the and then you heard him say to Mike Lima yeah. once again. All right, so now you can contact Bradley approach on your way up. Five three five. One twenty five thirty five. Yep. It is it about these fogs that makes me go left? Ah. Uh. Lima, CR, Charlie, Whiskey, turn right, heading at 350, effective to the final approach course. Action 702, contact Boston Center 134.3, we'll see you. 343, Action 702. Camjet 801, turn left, heading 120, effective to the ILS 24 approach. Left 120, Bradley approach, November 172, Mike Lima, through 5,600 for 6,000. Alpha Lima, CR, Charlie, Whiskey, descend and maintain a 5,000. Lima, CR, Charlie, Whiskey, menu altitude, maintain 7,000, please. Alpha Lima, CR, Charlie, Whiskey, menu altitude, maintain 7,000. Bradley approach, Roger. Okay, 
Damage at 801 descend and maintain 5,000. 5,000, yeah. your course to Hartford. We should call him up because we still haven't checked in with him. Bradley approach number 172, Mike Lima, level 6,000. Seven two, Mike Lima, Bradley approach, Bradley Altimate three zero one one, confirm information, Papa at Hartford. Three zero one one, and we'll get uh, Papa. One seven two, Mike Lima. Route two, Mike Lima, expect the uh, visual approach on way two. Two, Mike Lima, requesting the uh, VOR Alpha for uh, training. Route two, Mike Lima, Roger. Route two, Mike Lima, the VOR Alpha is out of service. Okay, stand by. We'll we'll see what we can do. There is the LD. Was it the um, LDA? Uh, was that the other one? There's an LDA zero two. Yeah. So, ask him. To tell him we'll be. Uh, we'd like to request the LDA zero two. South Lima, Sierra, Charlie, whiskey, turn left, heading two seven zero. Good morning, Bradley. Sirius 213, Whiskey Delta, level 8.5. Sirius 213, Whiskey Delta, Bradley, approach Bradley, Ultimate 3011, say destination. 3011, Lima, November Sierra. Roger, Lima, November Sierra for 3 Whiskey Delta. Bradley, approach 172, Mike Lima, request LDA 02 at Hartford. Uh, to Mike Lima, expect the LDA, LDA runway two approach. Expect LDA zero two one seven two Mike Lima. I'm getting eight zero one contact approach one two three point nine or five. Twenty three ninety five gamut eight zero one. Okay. Eight is one. Well, let's see. Got a while to go, so I want to load this. On course. Cross Lima, Sierra, Charlie Whiskey, turn left heading 250, descend and maintain 3000. We're going right now. We're going to Hartford. No. I got you direct to Hartford already. That's your current, that's your current flight plan. So, no need to mess with your flight plan itself. I think you can just load your approach. Because that's the airport that's active at the moment. No. Or maybe not. Oh, Hartford. there you go. No, 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 no. Hartford, approach. LDA 02. Load approach. Got Lomas. Lomas. And and is that the miss? Rambo's the miss. Okay. So the way we'll ask for this is direct Lomas for the procedure turn. Because the IAF at the moment, IAF is we got.
that's what the GPS is taking you to. Did you see that? I thought right now. We're, oh, right now we're going. Right now we're just going to the airport. We haven't yeah. used loaded the approach, but yep. just be aware. Uh, go to your approach frequency. Actually, yeah. So this is this is the whole approach. It starts at Weegot. So you're gonna have to start at Willomus when you once you get cleared the approach to go direct Lomas for the holding. See what I mean? You want to skip We Got, go straight to Lomas. Right, because what's going to happen is if you go to We Got, you got no way to revert. You're coming in from the north. You need to do some kind of course reversal. So you have to go here to Lomas, do the teardrop for the course reversal inbound. Otherwise, you're going to be... Golf Team Lima, Sierra, and Golf Lima, Sierra, Charlie Whiskey Turn, right heading 270. You're going to be in no man's land over here. We Got is an IF, right, but there's no way to contact Boston approach turn, turn onto the course. But I have to get vectors. That's the frequency is Oh, well, three, if you zero, want to get one, vectors, three, that's three, fine. Three, point, yes. Yes, let's do vectors then. That'll work. Angel Flight 1362, it's 330. So let's get the ATIS while we're, okay. while we're inbound. Golf Lima Sierra Charlie Whiskey turn right heading two nine zero Westfield Airport. Three o'clock one five miles. Question one zero miles. Probably a way to do it from there, but anyway. One two six four five. Angel flight thirteen sixty two. Yeah, I tried to catch you. It's thirty three zero. This is Brandon Tower 8, this information pop up. Tower 1253 Zulu, when calm, visibility is 10. Now, clear. Uh, 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 Landing and deporting, runway 2, please report to use. Brandon, no turn. Rear or Alpha approach, not authorized. Man, equipment, salt with the airfield. Cause for burning while effectivity in the vicinity of the airport. If requested via for a flight follow, advise ground control of destination and altitude. If flight knows the bit procedures, advise tower when initial contact. Departure 876 Alpha Delta 4000. Departure 876 Alpha Delta 4000. Departure radar contact. Departure 1000. Turn right heading at 360. 1000 right 3. This is Brandon Tower 8. This information pop up. Tower 1253 Zulu. When calm, visibility is 10. Sky condition clear. Tip 25. 2.19. Altimeter 3010. Landing and departing when we two visual approach to use. Bring it no turn. View or alpha approach now at the right. Contact with the airport. Airport to be a flight follow it advise ground control of destination and altitude. If flight knows the bit procedures, advise time. Did you get the winds? Yep. Calm. What's that frequency? Oh, Yankee approach, disregard. I am... Number six, Alpha, Delta, turn right direct to <laughs> Mount Washington Regional. Contact uh, Boston Center 134.3. 32 3 miles to Hartford. Mount Washington, six off Delta, good day. And I want to request vectors to we got. No, you just request vectors to the LDA. You don't even need to request vectors to a point. Yes. LDA zero two. So yeah, approach low. if if approach um we'll see what approach tells you. They could just start giving you vectors and then you accept vectors or they may clear you direct to Lomas. Two Mike Lima contact approach one two three point nine or five. One two three nine five one seven two Mike Lima. So with this call to approach, you can say. Number seven three Charlie Papa contact Providence approach one two three point six seven twenty three sixty seven. So you can say. Uh, approach one seven two Mike Lima level six thousand with Papa requesting vectors. 
LDA runway two. Get it all out at once. Yeah, that's yep. a mouthful. Try it. <laughs> Yankee approach November 172, Mike Lima, level 6,000, cross vectors for LDA 02. 172, Mike Lima, Bradley approach, Roger, expect LDA runway 2 approach. Bam! Expect LDA 02 approach, Harper, 172, Mike Lima. You forgot the pop-up, but that's okay. I knew, I, when I said it, I was like, what am I missing? <laughs> Did I tell him? Nope. Approach, good morning. Medivac Star Check 62 is with you 12-3, descending 11,000, Charlie. All right, so we're going to check Medivac 62, Bradley approach. Bradley, it's number 3011. It is Charlie Bradley. Expect a visual approach, runway 24. All right, we'll expect a visual 24, Star Check 62. Star Check 62, descend and maintain 5,000. 5,000, I'll start check 62. We're right over Westover. Charlie Echo Fox. The one Sierra Fox shot contact approach, 119.0. 19, not a good day with Sierra Fox. Number 15 Juliet, radar service terminate. Squawk VFR, Oxford Tower, 118.47. Good day. Squawk VFR uh, to Oxford Tower, 5215 Juliet. Thank you. I don't know that that's going to happen. Yep. Right. Okay. LDA 02 Hartford. Hello. Okay, so we're going to do vectors, Bomus, 2500. Bomus, 2500. Bands, 680. That is my circling minimum. Bradley approach, Beach Crowd 555, Charlie Charlie, 4000. Let's just do the straight in approach. Five, 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 Charlie Charlie, Bradley approach. So Bradley no circle. 3012, state destination. To right. land, just to straight yeah, in like land. Roger. Oh, I thought there were still, there's still a little, okay. It's it's a little bit off, but uh, you can use a different minimums if you're just going, doing a approach, straight in. Beach Crowd 555, Charlie Charlie, could you uh, well, confirm same, my right? altitude? No, right here. Charlie Charlie, I'm showing you 4000. 480, 460. Did you get identified? Because, so, Did you oh. say 4,500? Charlie, Charlie, affirmative, that's what I'm showing you at. Uh, Since you can identify Dan's, you can go down to 460. Okay, 20... 2,200 at Lomas. 80 Dan's, after Dan's. I can go to 460. Check my back to 62, turn right heading 060. 060, start 62. I'm going to have a four Romeo Alpha, turn right heading 270. I'm going to have a right turn to 02. Turn right heading 270, four Romeo Alpha. 18 feet. So just let me show you a couple things on this. Yeah. You want to change, if you want to change the uh, localizer frequency, this says push nav, so when you push this button, it switches over to the nav frequencies. Right, it should automatically switch over 109.7. Yep, it's right there. It. So, you know, you can flip it in. And then the other thing is, once you're flying the approach, if you go to the default nav page, right now you're on GPS guidance. If you want to go to the LDA guidance, you're going to have to press the CDI button right there, and that'll switch you to the localizer uh, guidance. Whoops. That was on the default nav. That's default nav. And now how do I go back to GP? 
GPS. <laughs> that is... Okay, yeah, you're on GPS. And there's the V-lock. See how it toggles? Just hitting the CDI. Yeah, just hitting the CDI. So now we're on GPS again. All right. How did you get the localizer? Press CDI. No, sorry, the localizer frequency? Press this button. So it's already loaded in because it even says Hartford localizer because you program the approach. Right. So you just have to flip it in. You can flip it in now, actually. 